And what's up, my beautiful Scorpios? And welcome to my channel. I hope all of you guys out there are doing well. So, Scorpio, we're going to see what messages Spirit has for you guys, okay? We're going to start off with some messages through music, Scorpio, okay? So, if anything resonates for you guys, go ahead and like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also, when I do these messages to music, you guys, if you are not familiar with the song, you guys, we on YouTube, go ahead and check that shit out, okay? All right, so messages from my Scorpio. Give me some messages through music, Spirit. All right, so we have Color Me Bad. Ooh, I want to set you up. So, Scorpio, somebody in your energy, they like, I ain't Scorpio over here looking good, okay? And this person want to come set you up all night long, okay? So, if you see this here, this is a channel song, okay? So, this is a song that was channeled to me <coughs> at one point in time, Scorpio. So, there's somebody in your energy, Scorpio, that's saying they want to come fix you up all night long, Scorpio. They know it's your birthday about to come up, Scorpio. They just want to come bring you some birthday sex, baby. Give me some more messages from my Scorpios, okay? And this could have been this person that wanted to come set you up, Scorpio. You could have met this person while you were young, okay? You and this person, y'all go back, y'all go way back to your childhood, Scorpio. So this could have been someone you could have been freaking up on. Or could have been sexing up on, you know what I'm saying? Back in the day, Scorpio. Back in the day when you was grown and not a kid. And some more, okay? And this, look at this, Rihanna, okay? You're the one, okay? And this person, Scorpio, this person want to sex you up. This person that you could have been dealing with, Scorpio, to go all the way back to your childhood, Scorpio. This person feels like you are the one for them, Scorpio, okay? So you guys, check that song out with Rihanna. You're the one, okay? So, let's see. Let's pull a no cap. Let's go here. All right, y'all know she get real with this no cap bit. So we about to see what was going on with you and this person, Scorpio, okay? Some messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more about this person that's thinking about my Scorpios. Okay, so Scorpio, this person that's thinking about you, that's want to say you up, Scorpio, that feel you are the one. This could be someone, Scorpio, that has gone through or that is going through some type of karmic lesson, okay? So this is someone that possibly could have been dealing with a karmic. You know, they were dealing with someone who was put in their life, Scorpio, to teach this person some type of lesson, okay? Then we have, I didn't know this shit would be so hard, okay? So Scorpio, possibly this person that's going through this karmic lesson or this person that's dealing with this karmic, okay? They didn't realize maybe this lesson, okay? Or maybe the things that they've, you know what I'm saying? They got to reap what they sown as well, okay? So this person realized they was out here, you know what I'm saying, dropping a lot of bad seeds and apples around this mug, okay? So now this person's realizing that something is very hard, okay? Maybe it's hard to walk away from this karma, okay? Or maybe this lesson that they're going through is just too hard, okay? So give me some more messages for my Scorpios. Okay, Scorpio, this could have been someone that doesn't like to be by themselves, Scorpio, okay? So one of the karma lessons that this person possibly could be learning at this time, Scorpio, is just to be by themselves, you know what I'm saying? Experience loneliness because sometimes, you know, people don't like to be by themselves because they say when you're lonely, you know what I'm saying, that silence speaks volumes, okay? So when this person's by themselves, you know, they, they mind all them, the things that's planned in their mind, all them things that they done done, Scorpio, you know what I'm saying? It's like they mind start playing tricks on them, okay? So this could have been someone that was like, you know, jumping in and out of beds, relationships, you know what I'm saying? Because they didn't want to be by themselves, okay? And this person is hoping, Scorpio, that it's not too late, okay? So, Scorpio, this is what I feel like they want to come in and have some makeup sex, you know what I'm saying? This person wants to let you know, Scorpio, that they feel that you are now the one, okay? This person is saying they learned their lessons, okay? They learned from their mistakes, and they're hoping that it's not too late, Scorpio, okay? So, we're going to pull, let's pull up one more message here, and then we're going to pull some tarot. And we're going to see what happened in this situation. So, give me one more card for my Scorpio spirit. Give me another card for my Scorpio spirit. What messages do you have for my Scorpio? What messages do you have? Okay. <clears throat> And Scorpio, this is someone that is proud of you, Scorpio, okay? Because this person did not think that you had the strength to walk away from the Scorpio, okay? So this person that has learned their karma lesson, this person that didn't know it would be so hard, Scorpio, this is someone that you had to walk away from, Scorpio. But this person did not think that you had the strength to walk away from the Scorpio, okay? They thought, they thought. And whoever this person is, Scorpio, this person is hurting financially, okay? So this person, if they want to come towards you, Scorpio, this person may not feel like that they have a lot to offer 
offer. And you could have felt like this person, they talk to you, Scorpio. It's like they, you want this person to communicate, to talk to you, not at you, Scorpio, okay? So let's pull some messages here. Let's see. Let's see who my Scorpios was dealing with. We're going to pull from this deck. All right, messages for my Scorpio spirit. Tell me about this person that my Scorpios was dealing with, okay? Why does this person hope it's not too late to come back to my Scorpios? Give me some messages for my Scorpios spirit. Messages for my Scorpios. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? I love you, Scorpio. Give me some more messages from my Scorpios. Who is this person? Look at this five of wands, okay? This could have been a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, you guys. This is someone that stayed in their mind, okay? This is someone that stayed in mental conflict. They always had mental anguish, okay? It was like they had this little bird or something was always yapping in their ear, telling them this and then and that. But this person is trying to release and say, look at this person now. Okay, you see these birds flying? This person is trying to release that mental conflict, okay? That, that mental imprisonment that this person always kept themselves in, okay? Give me some more messages for my Scorpios, dude. Messages for my Scorpios. Okay, yes, and this is someone, Scorpio, maybe they're trying to get rid of this mental anguish because this is someone that wants to come and take a leap of faith with you, Scorpio, with this fool card, okay? This person wants to be free. Look how this person is stretched out, and look how their arms are stretched out. This person wants to be free, Scorpio, and this person feels like that you're the person that can bring them this freedom, okay? That's why this person is hoping that it's not too late, Scorpio, because this is someone that wants to come in and take that leap of faith with you, Scorpio, and this is someone who, you know what I'm saying, you possibly had to set some boundaries with this nine of wands energy, okay? This Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. It's like you had to be by yourself. You had to learn how to be by yourself. You learn. You had to learn how to set boundaries, okay? You had to protect your energy when it came to this person. Because this person was always coming to you with this mental conflict. You know what I'm saying? This person was always in their head. It was like they really didn't know what they wanted in a relationship, okay? And this person had to let go of these toxic addictions, okay? This person could have had some unhealthy addictions. You could have felt like you had an unhealthy bond to this person. You see this stream? I feel like this is like a voodoo doll, you know what I'm saying? Like somebody doing some sex magic or you feel like this person, they had such a strong hold on you, okay? But you had to let go of this and this person also, they had to let go of these toxic energies, okay? For some of you guys, this person had to let go of this person that they had to learn this karmic lesson from Scorpio so that they could be the right person for you, okay? This is all I have, Scorpio. I love you and stay blessed.